so um, I just gotta be careful that I'm not run over with that that kind of a petty attack right away. Um, but in this map, uh, Zerg drops are like impossibly strong. There's all that high ground, and it's so easy to drop his mineral only expansion. It's so easy to drop his main, uh, and all the all, so all sorts of drops are like immensely powerful in this map. It's like almost imbalanced, or something like uh, <laughs> I don't even know. Like they're always do so much damage. It's so easy to just drop a couple of hydras and focus fire on their nexus or something. Uh, it's not even funny. Um, over here, uh, I noticed that I I minored a couple of drones. I had a that's a that's simply because I had a good satura saturation. Uh, I had enough drones. Uh, it's very important that you get enough drones early on. Um, and later on, uh, especially uh, since that way you can get like almost twice the unit production you normally get. Like you might wonder why all these play good players get a lot of units, like and they have plenty of money and all that stuff. It's sim even though they have very few expansions, uh, it's simply because they have enough drones. Like I have quite high uh, drone rate over there. It's probably like. 12 drones at least mining minerals. Um, I start one socket colony over there just to be sure that uh, it's not quite as susceptible to DT, DT harasses and such. Uh, I'm bringing my lurkers over right away. It's very important that I don't just sit in my base and let him like stay there or something. I gotta bring my lurkers over. I gotta add some some more pressure. I made quite a quick lurkers, so I doubt that he has observers yet. He could since uh, he has like pretty quick uh, quick stuff overall but uh i i seriously doubt it um so right now i'm just massing over I, I was able to get my third gas which is which is very crucial for uh zerg and now that i have him contained and he's kind of doesn't know where i am or what i'm doing i can i can prepare for a very powerful drop um which i made the upgrade for earlier i also got to get some new uh, um my tech up uh I'm gonna need a hive. In ZVP, a hive is very, very important. Though normally I would get a slightly faster hive even, but this time I decided to go for a drop since it's so powerful in this map. So um, that's why my hive is a bit later than normal. Over here, uh, I'm I'm dropping its expansion. Uh, like I said, the, these drops are like so powerful in this map. It's it's like impossible. Uh, there's really so much uh, damage you can do with it, just a couple of drops. Uh, it's it's really no joking matter um, like uh, I can instantly access his mineral line uh, I can just focus fire on his nexus or something it's really such a massive thing over here I blocked it, the ramp with uh, two lurker eggs I don't know if they, if they can run past or not but it's simply for buying me enough time like I was a bit careless I let a couple of my units run a run down the ramp which made them easy targets for his units uh, so I decided to buy a little bit of time by bringing those two lurker eggs over there and starting to morph them uh, it was enough that I was able to kill that nexus at, at his natural and it's also enough that uh, like one of my lurkers was able to kill that off enough of a lot of probes uh, and so on uh, I keep messing up also notice how I added another extra hatchery I'm gonna need it I have a I have too much spare money and so on so and, and I need to spend everything I also expand uh, again uh, I had the chance and uh, and so on um, at this point I'm just massing up I'm preparing I'm thinking of doing another drop but because I noticed that he's already moving out over here I, I just decided that I I'm just gonna just stop this army right over here uh, instead of dropping since it's kinda risky to drop when I'm especially when I'm leading since I might lo lose so much more uh, I notice how I had a very uh, all my units hotkey. I was instantly able to make a perfect flank in the map without even looking. It's very necessary. Um, so now I pretty much make a massive surround over here, uh, and hopefully it's good enough to destroy his army. Um, and I'm I'm pretty sure that it is since I I had a pretty good economy over here and I had my money spent quite well over here. I have a bit too much surplus, but it really doesn't make much of a difference. Um, notice that uh it's because I lost that battle uh, because I lost that battle I started a few sunken colonies over there just to buy a little bit of time and so on uh, 
it's actually very necessary that I that I started these sunken colonies. I want this exp keeping this expansion is very necessary, and I cannot do that unless I have something to help me out when defending and so on. Like a sunken colony is the last resort of a good zerg. You don't sunk a colony up uh, if it's like useless. You'd rather just build hatcheries and build a massive blob of units. It's much more useful. But a sunk building sunk a colony is kind of like the last attempt you make to defend uh, your expansion. Uh, over here, he wanted to get my expansion. It wasn't very wi wise of him to simply move out with a dragoon and templar army. But uh, he wanted to get that expansion down, so that's what. Uh, no matter what he needed that because I killed his expansion I killed his expansion and um and and I have a, like uh five bases myself or something so he needed to kill that expansion but now that he wasn't able to the game is pretty much over um uh, like I I cannot see what he can do unless I screw up terribly or something. Of course he has uh, it, it's a map where where he has three bases easily, and so on. And I'm taking that that to account. But I just destroyed his army quite e easily. And uh, besides that, I I also uh, destroyed his expansion at, uh, earlier. The mineral only. So his economy is no doubt like only half of mine. So there's really no way. That that his army could possibly beat my army anymore. Notice that I saved these two, two hydras before um, from my previ previous drop and now I'm able to use these lurkers to add a slightly more pressure, slow that mineral uh, in income and such even more when his army is away. Um, that was a pretty weak attack of me, uh, it was just one group of units or something. Um, he's also moving out, so I got I gotta keep moving.